Hey guys, welcome back to another Mash Brothers video, and today I'm gonna be showing. I, I, well, actually, no. First thing, I changed the game a lot. The game has changed. It, it's a totally different game, but with the same cards. So, basically, I'm just showing you some new cards. I have five, and uh, so the this new one compared to the other one that you guys saw, I like this one a lot better. And basically. Uh, I'll, I'll just show you where everything is, but, um, the cards weren't official, like, I left everything down here pencil, so I was able to erase and actually just keep all these cards, so. Anyway, so, I don't think I showed Swordman Silver, if I did, then, you know, here it is again, but, here's his, uh, stat change, so, the new game is kind of the same, but basically, I guess the one thing you'll need to know is, you have 50 energy per game. So once you run, like, run out of energy, you would lose. Or like if your deck is destroyed, you would lose. So he only costs 2, so he's really cheap. He's got a 150 attack, 150 health. So And then Slasher, this is a new card. And up here there used to be like a number, but I got rid of it because I don't need it. So, he's a 4 with 250 and 250. And actually, each each cost, they gain 50 attacks. So, 3s are 200, 200. And then 4s are 250, 250. 2s, 150. So, that's basically how it works. And it goes up to 5. And then it skips right to 8. And which 8s are, like, the most strongest battlers. So, it's Slasher. This is probably one of my favorite cards. I really like that one. Here's Nerf, and actually, uh, no one probably knows this, but this is the same Nerf as in my old Match Bowers, Match Bowers Megas, because the bottom was the same thing as these ones, it was all pencil because I didn't finish it, so I just erased it and just added it onto this game, so I just got like a free card, basically. So this is the 5, 300, 300, um, it's not like that huge of a difference, but, you know, it's there. And then I added spells, but spells aren't like normal TCGs where like spells are just like you use them, they have one effect, they go away. These spells are kind of more like, I guess like items or like a like building kind of cards. So this one costs four, I believe. I was going to change it to four. Has 300 health plus 50 attack to all your battlers. So basically for as long as this card's alive, all of your battlers get 50 attack. So let's say you've had Slasher and Swordman on the field. You can place down a power source in the back, and then they would gain 50 attack until this dies. Now, if they have, let's say, like a nerf. can't really see it. But let's say this was theirs, these were yours. These are in front of the spell, but really, this nerf can attack this before they can attack these. So it's not, like, really OP. Because if you had to attack the battlers before these spells, it, it would just be, like, really bad. Because some of the spells are, like, insanely good. Like, in this game, the battlers aren't really super special. The only thing that's special about them is the art. While the spells are, like, the main point of the game. This is where all, like, the effects and, like, the actual kind of, like, strategy comes from. But the battlers are the only cards that can attack. And the battlers have a thing called a uh, shield. Where you flip a coin, and if you keep on landing heads, you keep on just getting heads until you get tails. And then each head you gain 50. So if Nerf was attacking Slasher, and Slasher, let's say you got one shield, he'll have three, like, he'll block 50 attack. And then if you got two shields, he'll block 100 attack. And then let's say you got tails. Since he blocked 100 attack because you got two heads, it minuses 100 damage like incoming so you only take 200 so he'll survive so that's basically the shields work just to like, keep your battle alive and anyway, so this was the uh the first spell that i made watchtower see this card is actually kind of unique i never really made a card like this but um so it costs four but i'm not sure if i'm gonna change it I'm probably gonna keep it at four though i don't know if i'm gonna change this one but Opponent chooses one, minus two energy, or owner draws a card this last two turns. So basically, you get two effects of this. So, your opponent 
can either choose the minus two energy, so like they minus two energy off themselves, because they're choosing that, and then owner draws a card, so, you know, it's kind of, it's pretty good. So, this is mainly up to your, like, your opponent though, so you can't really choose, unless like they have like really low energy, they're probably going to choose owner draws a card. So, Watchtower is actually really good. So, this is basically what uh, I'm going to be showing for this video. So, I actually got a lot of, like, free cards because, like, I didn't finish them. I think I got, like, four cards from my old TCGs I was able to add in. So, I hope you guys enjoy. I honestly like this game a whole lot better than the other one. I think, like, the spells are kind of cool because, like, you know, I just think they're pretty cool. So, the decks are probably going to be like 20 cards, maybe 10 battlers, 10 spells. I don't really know. So, like, comment, subscribe to see more. That's it for this video. And, uh, yeah.